Hey friends, this is Karen Lynch in the Wildwood Lifestyle Center Teaching Kitchen, where today, as always, we're making another simple, nutritious, and delicious recipe. We're gonna make a rustic zucchini stew. So this recipe really resonates with my heart because I grew up in an Italian family and we always had a garden full of tomatoes, zucchini, and we always had an abundance of vegetables. So this recipe, I give credit to my family and especially my mom. So here are our ingredients today. We have some onions sliced. We have some cubed tomatoes. I'm using Roma tomatoes today. We have some zucchini. I've cut them into half moon shapes. A little bit of water some oregano, salt, and olive oil. And that is it. All right, you're gonna find out that soups and stews are probably the easiest recipes you can do. Again, this is another one, everything is just gonna go in the pot. But we're gonna start first with our onions. We're gonna saute them in just a little bit of water. And the reason why I'm not using olive oil is actually a couple reasons. The first reason is, is when you're sauteing with olive oil, you really are not monitoring how much you're using. So you get a lot of fat in your dish. The second thing is that when we bring oil to a high temperature, it breaks down the molecular construction of the oil, which causes it to be actually a carcinogen. So it's nice if you want that olive oil flavor, you're gonna see, I'm gonna put that olive oil in at the end to not only give it that smooth mouthfeel, but that deliciousness that the olive oil brings to the recipe. So once the onions are kind of starting to soften, we're gonna add some tomatoes. We'll let these kind of boil down until they become a little soft and more like a tomato sauce. So once those tomatoes start cooking down a little bit, we're just gonna add our zucchini. If you've noticed, I haven't added any water other than that little bit of water to saute the onions because these vegetables are so full of moisture and water that you're gonna make that soupy broth. Now we're just gonna let these vegetables start to cook down a little bit. You can leave your pan on high because it'll actually expedite this process. All right, so we've allowed these vegetables to kind of boil down to become nice and soft and almost like a stew. And now I'm gonna add the seasonings. We have some oregano. I'm using Himalayan pink salt. And lastly, I'm gonna add a little olive oil. Again, this is just actually gonna give us that flavor and that little bit of smoothness. And that's it, our rustic zucchini stew is done. All right, as always, the best part, let's give this a try. The freshness of this zucchini stew is amazing. It just pops with great tomato and onion and zucchini. You are gonna love this. Well friends, our time is up here at the Wildwood Lifestyle Center Teaching Kitchen, but I wanna invite you to go to our YouTube channel, DIY Health, or our Facebook page, Wildwood Lifestyle Center.